Okay everyone, so there's your exchange rate for today. Uh, yeah, I hate to say it like the your exchange rates have been short, in other words. Going across over here and head down the lot alley there. I will pause you while I'm waiting to cross. Okay guys, so we are going to be heading down the side of the tiki bar. But that's not the bar we're going to be filming. So of course, just for to say you, I've need the Filipinas there. Florida Pasta Luria, there up the corner. The Diga on the corner as well. Our cost gold in the background. <laughs> so just head off down here then. Sprinkle this on. You need to wash that. Anyway, what we are looking at is, of course, just down here, a brilliant little bar, guys, called Banana Beach Bar Benny Dorm. They're on TripAdvice or Facebook. think they're also on Instagram, I'm not too sure, but they are a good bar. They do good cocktails, great food. Fish finger sarnies. Great little bar, guys. But the thing is, it's not getting any customers. Very sad, I mean. I imagine many of the bars down this area ain't getting much. So, it's <laughs> out. I mean, as you can see, Sin City Bar <laughs> looks like, like it hasn't been open for quite a while, to be fair. Same with Tattoo Studio here. And, of course, restaurant just there. Yeah, but it is sad for these bars, guys. Yeah, they're at a delay, then not on the seafront, but that's in a great bar, guys. I mean, you look at Tiki Bar just there on the corner, always seems busy. Of course I do. Right on seafront, view of the beach. Of course I'm always busy, but bananas bar, the banana beach bar here, shut today but normally when they are open, rather quite quiet. English breakfast, 5 euro guys, burgers 7 euro, mixed dishes like 50, you can get nachos, chicken wraps, pizzas which I've been told are very good, very, very tasty. Jugs of granita cocktails as well. Um, strawberry tequiri, Long Island iced tea, pina colada, traditional sex on the beach, fat frog, and um, one I've never heard of, crazy watermelon. Also, bucket deals as well. Plus five soft drinks. Believe you're getting some big bottles there, so big bottle of man off, and you're getting five cans of Red Bull, so you can do five of Red Bull. Anyway, guys, um, the lad who does, of course, own the bar, apparently a huge fan of the channel, so do me all a favour, guys. When you're here in Benidorm, check the bar out. Give him a chance. 
but inside the game, somewhere you'll normally go, i.e. Waikiki, go here. So that, it's a bit set back, but it's a beautiful bar, guys. Now, come on, give the smaller businesses a chance. Anyway, um, that's that done. Heading down towards the beachfront now. Absolutely glorious sunshine again. Can't see much, but rather surprising, eh? Beach is busy. Not sure if you can quite see that boat trip to Sorry. Peacock Islands back up in one in a sail. Um, but I wouldn't have thought that'd be running this time of year. Yeah, I thought that would have started again maybe mid March, but back up in one in again, guys, and um, I'm not too sure if you can see the two lads out there on the surfboards. Not a great day in the office, isn't yeah. it, Mike? You can't beat it, guys. You can't beat it. I mean, so and Mike went out down the front after Christmas dinner. Apparently seeing temperatures of 27 degrees. Now is that hot or is that hot? I mean Christmas day. 27 degrees. No. <laughs> That's perfect. And well, I do hate to rub it in but I see you guys had shit better lately. So, <laughs> you can't beat it. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here because it does appear like the police have actually done their jobs and pulled a potato pecan. I'm, I'm not sure if they've got them. They've got the box. Anyway guys, hit the like, hit subscribe, see you in the next one.